and welcome to Nick's Allotment Diary. Today I'm going to be planting the first seeds of the year. It's early January and to be honest there's not many seeds that you can plant at this time of the year. Uh, most seeds are best waiting until about February or March unless you've got the facility to have a heated propagator or under grow lights. What I'm going to do, I'm going to start off some onions because I'm impatient in getting something planted in January. So I have some seeds from a company called Just Seed. Uh, I'm not sponsored by this company, I've just uh, got these from the internet. Uh, I'm going to try a variety called Isabel Rose and these are a pink skinned onion um, with alternate pink and white rings. It does say you can start them in February. I'm going to give these an early start in a heated propagator. I prepared a seed tray with some compost and all I've done is I've just uh, used another back of another seed tray to press it down so that you've got a nice uh, firm base for your seeds and I'm going to tip out a few of the onion seeds you don't need too many there they are characteristic black allium seeds and all I'm going to do is just sprinkle them over the surface of the compost just try and spread them out a bit there we go and I'm going to cover them with vermiculite this is a light covering don't need to put too much over the top it's just to cover the seeds and keep them moist and I'll give them a little bit of a spray. The compost underneath is uh, damp, so there's no uh, reason to think those seeds won't be in contact with moisture. I'll just give them a good soaking with a spray bottle. I've prepared a label with what I've planted which I'll just tuck in the end of the seed tray like that and there we go the first seeds of the season planted I'm going to do one other tray now of a different type of onion which I'm just going to show you the other variety I'm going to plant today is a variety called Ailsa Craig this is um, a well-known onion does quite well they're yellow uh, onions just normal colored onions uh, straw colored skin giving reasonable yields 300 seeds in a packet won't need anywhere near as many as that again just level the surface of the compost it's all ready moist compost so don't need to do anything more to that. Just get a few seeds. And then sprinkle them over the surface of the compost. You can plant these much later in the season. Uh, straight into module trays or into directly into a bed if you want but I want to just get some off started early this year and I'm going to compare seed grown onions to ones that have been grown from sets so again I'll just quickly put some vermiculite over the surface cover them over 
You can just cover them over with compost, of course. Um, I've got plenty of vermiculite, so I'm going to give this a go. Quickly, give those a bit of a spray. And I prepare the label. There we go. So now we have our Isabel Rose and Ailsa Craig onions. And what I'm going to do is put them in a heated propagator, which I'll just show you now, the one I've got. And I will then take that home and start them off on a windowsill. They don't need much heat to get going. They just need basically some bottom heat just to get them started. Once they've germinated, you can remove them from the heat because they're very hardy onions. And they'll be fine in the greenhouse until I'm ready to uh, prick them on to um, modular trays, ready to go out in probably two or three months time. It's the heated propagator tray. There's a piece of capillary matting that goes in the bottom. This is a new propagator I bought at the end of last season. Got it uh, to reduce price. It's not a big one, so it's fine for starting a few things off. So I'm just going to put these couple of trays in there and then there is a clear perspex cover and sure if you can see that with the sun glinting on it but there is a vent at the top that you can open I'll leave it open to uh, make sure there's plenty of ventilation and these should germinate within seven to ten days probably and once they're up about 14 days I will take them out of the heated propagator and bring them back down to the allotment so that I can grow them on in the greenhouse. So there we go, there's the first seeds planted of the year. It's great to be back growing again. Thanks very much for joining me at Nick's allotment. I'll see you again next time.